Welcome back everyone. Today I'm going to be commencing my review of the Super Mario Bone Piranha Plant action figure. Is this action figure a paragon of resounding perfection or should it be relegated to the dumpster or is it characterized by insipid underlying mediocrity in the form of a quantitative score? I'd have to raise this action figure to be a 7 out of 10 at best. Is it meritorious? Is it stupendous? Well, he has high quality shadings, high quality textures, high quality paint applications, and of course a high quality sculpt. Unfortunately, much to my dismay, much to my consternation, his accessories are scant. He only comes bundled with a plastic coin, which is unfortunate, but it is what it is. Dismay is unequivocally unsealed. I am perturbed. Nonetheless, he does have some redeeming qualities. He is the first of his kind to stand four inches tall. In other words, there has never been a four to four point five inches tall bone piranha plant action figure released on the market. I have to utilize an $8 Toby's More Volitions action figure as a benchmark for comparison of value. This action figure is decent. However, unfortunately, he lacks a Build-A-Figure he lacks a Build-A-Figure piece for a behemoth of a robust, colossal, meticulously detailed 14 and 16 inch build a figure. He's also devoid of a comic book, and unlike an $8 Tobin's More Fleshens action figure, he's not sporting 32 to 40 points of articulation. In spite of the fact that he commands a lofty, staggering, exorbitant premium price of $10 plus sales tax, which is 25% greater than the retail price of an $8 Tobin's More Fleshens action figure, if you recollect, if you recall, those action figures were meticulously detailed. They had high quality shadings, high quality textures, high quality paint applications, high quality designs, high quality decos, and they came with high quality accessories. But I deem this action figure to be a high quality action figure. Yes. It would have been ineffably epic if he had a weathering effect. It would have been preferable if. Um, paint washes were utilized to accentuate his paint applications. I would have preferred if he were taller. Does he coincide eminently well with the 67-inch prodigious action figure collection? No. So how could this figure have been improved? What would have rendered him, what would have rendered this action figure worthy of a 10 out of 10 review score? Well, if he came bundled with a build a figure piece or an additional figure as well as more accessories and if he stood at least seven to ten inches tall then I more than likely would have rated him to be a 10 out of 10. His articulation is scant his accessory is meager Most action figures will tower over him. This bone piranha plant is relatively small. If you recollect, the $8 Tobias Marvel Legends action figure sometimes came bundled with an additional figure, such as Deadpool coming bundled with Duel, or Silver Surfer coming bundled with Howard the Duck, but that's not the case in this context. He's a standalone figure. In this context, collectors are paying more for less as opposed to less for more. Fortunately, much to my relief, he can at least chomp his jaw. He should be able to rotate his stem. His going seems to be relatively sturdy. If it had a metallic sheen, that would have been inexplicably epic, to say the least. He's going to be dwarfed by most figures. His bone piranha plant action figure is just 
small. But it is what it is. I'm grateful that um, a bone piranha plant action figure was at least released. These action figures will more than likely be comfortable. So 7 out of 10 is my final verdict. I'm done adjudicating over this matter. I hope that you found this video to be enthralling and insightful. I hope that you were regaled and bedazzled. And I hope that you found this content to be engrossing. If you're an avid developed Mario fan, then he's worth picking up if he detests and disdain a Super Mario franchise and may want to forgo buying him. I hope that you found this video to be informative. Have a wonderful day and a blissful night. Goodbye.